like she's been with the facts about the cops, Heather's not afraid to go into these college campuses and take on these zealots. I loved it. Somebody, I don't know if it was you, but somebody tweeted out just a highlight of you at Berkeley recently. And they said, oh, it's really worth watching the whole clip. So of course, since I'm your huge fan, I went, I watched the whole thing. I watched the whole hour of you at Berkeley. And gosh, you, you're just totally fearless. Cause of course these college students got up there and were all over you. And you were like, boom, boom, boom. We have just a little bit of it. Cause yeah, cause we love you. We played it, played it already, but I'm going to play it right now. Sock 24. I just want to tell you right now that your book is racist. Your arguments are racist. They are based in eugenics. They are based in ideas that black people and brown people can never compete with white and Asian counterparts. Why should we take any of this seriously when it seems that none, nothing else that you want to do is just pedal, pedal, racist dribble? Well, if I believed that blacks can never compete, I would say, yeah, we've got to lower standards because that's the only hope for getting diverse institutions. In fact, I believe that if we held single standards and had high expectations uh, that blacks would compete as to your uh, misreading of, of, from my book, that was simply an empirical observation about the current situation in a regime of ubiquitous racial preferences. So you can admit uh, black students with a standard deviation below SAT grades into college, the gap does not close by the end of college. Clear. Let me just give you the data that explains why you can have diversity or you can have meritocracy, you can't have both. 66% of black 12th graders do not possess partial mastery of basic math skills defined as doing arithmetic or being able to read a graph. 66%, the number who are advanced in 12th grade math is too small to show up statistically on a national sample. That is the reality. That is why we do not have racially proportionate institutions. You said, how could we possibly be in an institution that's racist? Sweetheart, the name of the school oh. represents that. They just changed it like 10 minutes ago. There was a time that most of the people standing in this room would never be allowed on this campus. And I'm telling you that we didn't get here by wanting it, we worked hard. So for me to be here at this school that I pay to go to, that I worked hard to get into, and to listen to you say blacks this, black that, and welfare mothers and all this other extra bullshit saying that Asian students always, like all the things you're saying I think can be solved by education. And I encourage you to get yourself educated. Did you get yourself <laughs> educated after that, Heather? <laughs> you know, I said at the beginning that it was depressing to see the uh, the Floyd arrest video. And this was as depressing, but also obviously laughable because it's very depressing to see these black students who are the most privileged individuals in human history because they have at their fingertips the thing that Faust sold his soul for, which is knowledge. And in fact, they're surrounded by the most well-meaning adults. Think of themselves as victims. It's absolutely preposterous. We know that Berkeley, we know that the majority of them have been admitted to racial preferences by racial preferences. Why? Because Berkeley tells us that without racial preferences, it's not going to be able to get its critical mass of black students. So, so much does Berkeley want its black students, this is the law school, that it is admitting them with a standard deviation below in, in academic skills. And yet they're going around claiming that they are victimized by racism at the Berkeley Law School. It's utterly preposterous. And yet they are being cultivated to think this way by the entire diversity, equity, and inclusion bureaucracy, by presidents, by deans. This is, you know, this moment, it's very good that the the, the Minneapolis uh, documentary is coming, the fall of Minneapolis documentary is coming out now because the intersectional coalition that is being exposed by these pro-Hamas uh, demonstrations that will probably become riots uh, if if Israel continues its ground campaign. Uh, it just shows us the poison that the academy is spewing into the world. It is a poison based on lies. It is a poison based on hatred. And it is taking everything down, our standards, our public safety. We should demand public safety. It is not some white hang up to think that you should be able to go around cities uh, without worrying about getting pushed into subway tracks or mugged 
or robbed or having your car jacked when you're when you're filling your tank. These are normal expectations. And yet now we're told that it's somehow racist to to expect public safety and to expect the police to protect property and protect lives. Thanksgiving is one week away. It's time. We got to get on our horse. I mean, it's time. Thanksgiving is one week away. That means the best GenuCell sale of the year. Yay. And just in time for the holidays, the GenuCell most popular package is back for you to look stunning for your Thanksgiving gatherings. And with the brand new GenuCell 3 also included, you could look 10, 15, even 20 years younger with the best natural skincare anywhere. This is one of the things I love about the GenuCell products. They're not riddled with like weird perfumes. They're clean. The packaging is lovely. It's elegant. They don't overwhelm you with a bunch of scents and all that stuff. Uh, Sunny from Rockford, Illinois knows. She wrote in, I will give GenuCell five stars because the products they do, they send, do exactly what they promise to do. It's working. Take advantage of the GenuCell best sale of the year and say goodbye to fine lines, crow's feet, bags and puffiness, laugh lines, and dark spots. Look and feel your absolute best or you get your money back. No questions asked. Go to genucell.com slash MK podcast for better than 70% off on GenuCell's most popular package with GenuCell 3 and Dark Spot Corrector. And for results in 12 hours or less, you get the immediate effects product included for free. genucell.com slash MK, genucell.com slash MK podcast. If you could include MK podcast, that would let them know that you heard of us here. Uh, and go there now for a free upgrade to priority shipping. G-E-N-U-C-E-L dot com slash MK podcast. Hey, thanks so much for watching. If you like what you just saw, hit the subscribe button for more clips and full episodes.